LaptopKey.com, your source for replacement keyboard keys. Notice, many times, laptop manufacturers produce keyboards that look the same on the outside, but have different retainer clips underneath the keys. To help you find the correct repair video for your keyboard, we've created a searchable database. Simply go to LaptopKey.com, enter your laptop brand and model number, scroll down to the bottom of the page and click on View Videos. A list of all compatible videos will appear. Select the retainer clip model that matches your keyboard. That's all, you're now ready to repair your laptop keyboard. For this keyboard, we will be showing the removal and reattachment of the H key for standard size keys, Shift for the wide keys, and Unmute for the top row keys. To remove your standard size keys, insert a tool underneath the key cap from the upper right corner and apply gentle upward pressure to disconnect from the retention clips below. To remove the retention clip, support the bottom of the clip with your finger and insert your tool under the middle at the very top of the key. Apply equal pressure left and right to disconnect from the sports. To reassemble your clips, we'll begin with the top clip which has two smaller holes at the top and two larger at the bottom. For the bottom clip, there are two upward divots at the top and two support arms as well. Connect the two halves together ensuring that the plastic support arms of the top clip are in the openings of the bottom. You need to give it a little push down to connect everything together. Then we will connect it to the plastic pieces here and here for the top and here and here for the bottom. We will lay the clip down flat and press the top corners into their supports. Replace our keycap, a firm press, and we're functional. To remove the wider keys, insert your tool under the upper right corner of the cap. And apply gentle upward pressure along the top and bottom edges to disconnect from the metal support arms and the retention clips. To remove the metal support arms, lift up from the middle and push both ends towards the center. Repeat with the other arm. Then, to remove the retention clip, support the bottom of the clip with your finger, insert your tool at the top middle, a gentle pressure to either side to disconnect. To reassemble your clips, we'll begin with the top clip, which has two small holes at the top and two larger holes at the bottom. For the bottom clip, there are support arms and two upward divots at the top. Connect the two halves together making sure those plastic support arms from the top go into the holes on the bottom. We need to give the top one a small press downward. Then using plastic connections here, 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 and here, we will lay the clip down bottom first, flat, press the top corners into their support spots. Then to replace the metal support arms, we will use openings in plastic here, 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 and here, with the top set being for the top arm and the bottom set being for the bottom arm. Simply lay the arm down in the center vertically, pull back towards the edge it will be at and lay down flat, making sure that both sides of the arms are underneath the plastic. We'll then repeat bottom arm. Lay down flat. Replace our keycap. Press around the edges and in the center and we're functional. To remove the top row keys, insert your tool under the upper right corner. Apply gentle upward pressure and the keycap will be removed. To remove the retention clips, support the bottom of the clip with your finger. Push gently from the sides to disconnect from the plastic supports and the clip will be removed. To reassemble your clips, we'll begin with the top clip, which has two small holes at the top and two larger holes at the bottom. For the bottom clip, there will be two small support arms on the top end alongside two small upward divots. 
connect the two halves together, making sure the plastic support arms of the top go into the openings on the bottom clip. Then using the plastic supports here, 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 and here, we will place the clip down bottom first, connect both corners with a small press, replace the keycap with a firm press, and we are functional. We'll now show you how to remove a laptop key. Simply pull on the edge of the key in a gentle but firm motion. Lift up and remove the key. It's that simple. If your key is loose and not sticking properly to your keyboard, your retainer clips are likely broken. This issue can be fixed by replacing your retainer clips. Replacement laptop keys and retainer clips can be purchased at LaptopKey.com. LaptopKey.com, your source for replacement keyboard keys.